space is interesting. It's massive and full of mysteries just waiting to be discovered. We've done a great job at mapping out our solar system and finding out information on each celestial body that resides in it. Perhaps one of the most interesting things inside our solar system is that of the sun. The sun can be found at the centre of the solar system. Without it, life would cease to exist on the planet. It's responsible for many things, the main one being keeping us alive, but also other things which include influencing our planet's climate. It holds the title for being the largest celestial object in our solar system. Scientists have said it contains more than 99% of the total mass of the solar system, with the largest planet Jupiter containing just 0.2%. This giant is responsible for holding the solar system together. Scientists have said the Sun is around 110 times the diameter of the Earth. This means that over 1 million Earths could fit inside the Sun. Although the Sun is an incredible force, researchers have said there's billions of them throughout the Milky Way galaxy alone. The Milky Way is the second largest galaxy in our local group, with the Andromeda galaxy being the largest. Scientists have concluded that the Milky Way galaxy is around 890 billion times the mass of the Sun. Although many don't give this massive star much thought, it's important to note that teams across the planet are keeping a close eye on it. The outside of the Sun is over 10,000 degrees. However, that's nothing compared to the core, which can reach more than 27 million degrees. So it's common knowledge that the Sun is massive, which is why people get confused when they discover massive objects close to the Sun. Interestingly, NASA have come forward over the years and said these are nothing more than anomalies, and that sometimes strange shapes appear due to processing errors. So what happens then when someone captures a large object close to the Sun through their telescope? One individual sent me the following email. I thought you would find this image interesting. It was posted to various groups I follow, and many people on there couldn't seem to agree on what it was, although the majority of them said it doesn't look natural. The story behind this photo states that someone was looking through their telescope when they noticed a large object close to the sun. At the time they had a filter on their telescope and was able to see something massive. They quickly snapped an image, and could once again see the large object sitting close to the sun. The individual said though they had no idea what this was, and how something so big was just sitting there. This object is massive. They were quoted as saying the following. After seeing this massive object I knew I had to quickly snap a photograph. I've been looking through my telescope for well over a year now and I've never seen anything like this. This couldn't have been a processing error as the image wasn't passed through anything. This was what I could see with my eyes, and then this was taken via a camera device that attaches to the telescope. I'm not looking to get deep into any theories, I'm just looking for an answer for what this giant object could be. End quote. As you can imagine this caused a variety of different theories to be put forward, with some suggesting that what the person captured was some type of massive UFO. Although it sounds far-fetched, Theorists have said that one of the best places to capture UFOs is that of the Sun and Moon, saying that many strange unidentified flying objects are photographed here, and that the majority of these remain unexplained. As mentioned by the individual, when these photographs are captured by NASA, they usually say the reason these anomalies come up is because of processing errors, and in reality there's nothing there. But how do you explain these objects when everyday people are capturing them? Another person on the group said the following about the object. This isn't the first time and won't be the last that a photo like this surfaces. Every year people manage to capture similar looking objects. What's sad though is that this photo won't get the recognition it deserves. It's an incredible photograph and just thinking about what it could be gives me chills. Imagine what that thing is. The fact that it's just sitting there is amazing but daunting at the same time. 
perhaps there's things in this universe that at this moment in time we're not ready to accept. The mysterious photograph was taken on the 31st of August 2020, and the original person who snapped the photograph is still looking for an answer for what this object is. As of right now, UFO researchers think these crafts have been visiting our sun for years, and even suggest that they may be using it as some type of portal, or that the sun could be some type of fueling station. NASA has said the following about the anomalies that are seen around our sun. Ever since launch, there's been a number of people who've claimed to have seen flying saucers and other objects in SOHO images. Although some of these supposed pictures of UFOs can seem quite intriguing, they've always turned out to have quite an ordinary cause when examined by experienced SOHO scientists. Recently, we've been receiving so many questions and claims that we'd like to set the record straight. We've never seen anything that even suggests there's UFOs out there. In the past, we've been accused of covering up UFO evidence when we present our explanations, and of refusing to comment or clamming up when we give up on somebody who won't accept our explanations. While we don't expect to convince everybody, we hope that our pages and links can provide some information for the curious who want to investigate the claims on their own. Most commonly, UFO claims are due to perfectly natural flaws or artifacts in our publicly available data. Some of the things that people are seeing are planets, cosmic rays, software glitches and debris. Another NASA official said the following about these claims. The majority of these alleged UFO sightings can be easily explained. One of the things that people see is space debris that's made its way in front of the cameras. When these pieces of debris are up close, it can look like an unidentified flying object. In reality, people are just seeing a common piece of space debris. Many people, though, are not happy with this reply from the space agency, and have even gone as far as saying this explanation is lazy, and was just put there in order to keep people quiet. As of today, many of these mysterious-looking objects are still being captured by the space agency, along with amateur astronomers who are trying to get to the bottom of what these objects are. So what do you make of these mysterious objects captured close to the sun, and what do you think they are? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below, and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.